Tested. Hey guys, Will from Tested. And I'm Norm from Tested. We are here at Mobile Focus uh, at the Mirasol Qualcomm booth. Mirasol is a new display technology. That's a brand name, right? Yeah, Mirasol's a brand. What is the technology called, Will? Interferometric modulation. Interferometric yeah. modulation. Let's say it through that as fast. Interferometric modulation. Interferometric I modulation. I can't do that. I, That's impossible. What does that mean? Okay, so here's what it means. Okay. It means that inside this display, for each subpixel, there's a little tiny mirror, and there's a gap between the mirror and two pieces of glass. Mm -hmm. And what that does is, by reflecting the mirror at certain angles, they can produce specific wavelengths of light that work in a reflective situation, rather than a backlit situation. So what I took away from that, and I understood that completely, yeah. is that it's a reflective like an ebook reader, but because different wavelengths, that's colors. Colors, see, exactly. So e ink, colors, faster refresh rate. Um, this the actual display is running at about 15 frames per second. But it can do 30 frames per second easily. Right. And the big advantage, aside power. from power, and you can see it in the sunlight. So if we put it under a bright light, no problem seeing that. Isn't that pretty cool? That is super cool. Qualcomm's making the screen and also the controller chip that uh, allows for the, the refresh rate. It uses one milliwatt of power when it's in its solid state. When it's changing, when it's not moving, you mean? It's not moving like yeah. an ebook reader, you know, in off position. When it's animated, it's going to use about 20 milliwatts of power. Compared to an LCD on the like phone. 150 or 200 sometimes. 200 milliwatts of power. So on this screen, what is this? This is a 5.7 inch screen. This, the first devices using Mirasol are going to be this size, so you can imagine like small ebook readers. And what we hear is that they're going to actually get smaller. So for smartphones, super phones, we can see maybe in a year or two, super phones with screens that look like this where you can read on the beach. Really interesting, but I mean, again, it's a reflective screen, so it's not backlit, it's not going to work in the dark. But I mean, how often do you use your phone in the dark? Right, and it will, you will be able to get you know, a touch screen there on top of it. I don't think Qualcomm's actually doing the touch screen part. Like, it's no touch screen right now. But from the resolution is fairly good. I think it's like a two, around 250 uh, pixels per inch, okay. which is you know, very comparable to a high resolution smartphone. This is really exciting technology. I'm really stoked to, to see it in person and uh, hopefully in some devices. I think they said maybe some announcements at CES or first quarter of next year. So that is Mirasol by Qualcomm. Yeah. You saw it first here on Tested. What is the technology called? The Interferometric modulation. Interferometric modulation. Yes. Interferometric modulation. Yes. Tested. Bye.